George thought the best vegetables in the world came from the market. I was thinking about making vegetable soup tonight. <laughs> but that got me thinking about Chef Paschetti's fresh vegetable soup and spinach ravioli. <laughs> Are you thinking what I'm thinking, George? <laughs> Minestrone with extra carrots and spinach ravioli for two. Natty, stop! Don't take that order! Huh? Is something wrong, Chef Paschetti? Wrong? Oh, yes. I am all out of carrots and spinach. I, Paschetti, have failed you. Chef, can't you just go get some fresh vegetables? I don't want to keep them waiting. Oh, we'd wait all night for your fresh vegetables, Chef. Uh -huh. They're the reason we come here. <laughs> uh, you want to help me get fresh veggies off the roof, Giorgio? Oh. <laughs> Did he say the roof? Doesn't the grocer make the fresh vegetables at the market? You see other veggies grow on farms far away, then they travel to a store where they sit around until you buy them. My veggies grow here, go down to the kitchen, then to your belly on the same day. George didn't see any carrots here. Huh. Veggies come from dirt. <laughs> weeds! Weeds! Oh, you monster also! Oh, weeds are bad. Very bad. You see, weeds like this soak up the water and nutrients from the soil that my veggies need to grow. If my veggies can't grow, my food won't be piscati fresh. And if it's not, I will close it down. Oh. Yes. I will close my restaurant before I let anyone think Piscetti is not the best they ever tasted. I must pull those weeds, but after working hard all day, I'm too tired to get it all done. George couldn't stop thinking about Chef Piscetti's weed problem. After working hard all day, was too tired to get his work done. I didn't think you were paying attention. I'll start again. The shoemaker and the elves. Once there was a shoemaker who, after working hard all day, was too tired to get his work done. I am too tired to get it all done, he thought. But if I don't, my customer will have but one shoe and may hop over to another cobbler. He couldn't stay awake. As he slept, an amazing thing happened. Elves did his work for him. When the cobbler awoke, he didn't know how that shoe got finished. Aww. George wondered if a little monkey could be an elf for a chef. First thing the next morning, George did some secret elf waiting. George dug up every nasty green thing he saw. Three bags full. Hello, Giorgio. You want to come help me get fresh veggies for today's food? Now it was time for Elf George to see how happy he'd made the chef. I'm ruined! <laughs> it's all gone. The weeds and almost all of my veggies. What am I gonna cook? <laughs> <laughs>